Hey everyone, welcome back to a, another video. Today we are going to be talking about four different sneakers that I think every sneaker head should have in their collection that it's under $100 right now. So let's get into it. If you're new here and you like content about sneakers, lifestyle products, and collectible and designer toys, then consider hitting that subscribe button and also the bell icon so that you can be notified every single time I post a new video. But today I wanted to talk to you about four different sneakers that I have in my sneaker collection that I think every sneaker head should have. And let's just go through each one, uh, one by one. So the first sneaker that I think uh, everyone should have are Chalk Tailors. Chalk Tailors are super versatile. They come in a whole bunch of different colorways. And while probably not the most supportive shoe in your sneaker collection, uh, they definitely do get comfortable over time as you wear them. You can literally wear it with so many different outfit options. And I think that is the reason why I really love these shoes. They are great summer shoes for me that I like to wear when the weather is nice and I've opted for this white colorway with the blue and red accents. And for me, I don't, while I like to keep my sneakers clean, these are probably one of the sneakers that I try to, I don't intentionally keep clean because I think they look a lot better when they are a little bit uh, battered up and look kind of worn. It just gives that like vintage retro vibe for me of those people wearing it back in the day, uh, which is why these shoes aren't particularly clean as you can see. And as you can imagine, just keeping a white canvas shoe clean like this is, is really difficult um, so I think this is one of the shoes that every sneaker head should have in their collection so moving on to the next sneaker that I think everyone should have in their collection and I think they are a pair of Vans I actually have a pair of Vans I just didn't bring it in this video because they're so battered and beaten up because I wear them so much I actually just got two new pairs here uh, one here for the summer months which I think is really cool and then just another basic black with this floral pattern on it and I got these for super cheap off of Boathouse they were having a really good van sale but this is another sneaker that I like to wear on a daily if I'm just going to the grocery store or running some errands this shoe also molds your feet after a while again probably not the most supportive there's no arch support or anything in this shoe but a great shoe again that is so versatile that you can wear with so many different outfits and uh, under a hundred dollars as well and so many different colorways and if you go to Vans' website actually you can customize your own colorway of course it'll be over that hundred dollar mark but I think nonetheless it's a pretty good deal if you can find one where you really like the design there's so many designs out there so just hit up Google and see what you can find. The next shoe that I think is uh, really cool are these Reebok Club C85s. Uh, this is a shoe, this is a Pride Edition, so it's not under $100, but the, just the basic colorway ones. The plain ones are under $100 right now on the Reebok website. I love this all white look. So you can wear this with a lot of different things and outfits. Just a clean vibe, you know, and it's something that's a classic, classic shoe. <laughs> um, I love that, you know, Reebok is kind of embossed here and you have Reebok, but it's in this really light gray or white color. So you can barely see the branding on it, but I think it's a great shoe to have. I try to keep these as clean as possible because it just looks good with an outfit and then you just have a clean pair of white shoes. Uh, but definitely check these out. These are super comfortable. Not so much support, but pretty good. Better than the Chuck Taylor than the Vans in my opinion. Um, but definitely a shoe to add to your collection if you're looking for something different other than maybe Nike or Adidas. Speaking of Adidas, the, the last shoe that I wanted to feature were, are these. Um, Adidas Continental Volk, I think they're called. 
Obviously, again, this is a special edition, so it's not under $100, but the actual silhouette of the shoe, I think, is a pretty basic uh, shape and style, so you can wear it with a lot of different outfits again. And um, this is the shoe right here. Obviously, again, this is the Arizona edition, uh, the drink Arizona, so it was a little bit more expensive than it uh, typically is. These are also under $100 if you go for the plain, uh, you know, colorway and silhouette. So definitely check these out. These are really comfortable as well. And I think just a great shoe to have. I made this video because I realized I had all these different types of flagship shoes from each company and I realized that like I wear these shoes probably the most out of all the sneakers in my collection, right? So. I have a whole bunch of Air Jordan ones, but I would probably, if you know, I was going about my day, I would probably pull a pair of Vans out or my Chuck Taylors and I would just wear those, right? And I think it's great because these shoes, they're so popular that they come out in so many different colorways that it can essentially match your style and the aesthetic that you're looking for. So definitely check out some of the shoes that I had mentioned in today's video. I'll leave some links if I can in the description below to see if you can grab yourself a pair and I hope that you can find something that will match your style and I hope you got something out of it. Let me know in the comments below if you have any of these sneakers and if you agree with some of the choices that I made. Maybe I missed a shoe that I haven't tried out yet. I'm sure someone will mention like the Stan Smiths because they're so basic and so iconic to the Adidas brand. I just haven't tried them myself so I didn't feature them in this video but maybe in the near, near future I'll try them out and let you know what I think. But that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Hey everyone, thanks for checking out today's video. Please consider subscribing to see more content just like this. There is always more to see on my blog at www.writtenbyjust.com. Thank you for all your support and we'll catch you in the next one.